Ja, Nederland kan de komende jaren echt een marktleider worden als het gaat om de waterstof-economie. We hebben met de Rotterdamse haven, maar ook onze grasinfrastructuur eigenlijk ja, de ideale omstandigheden om hier zelf waterstof te produceren, maar ook veel waterstof te importeren. En daarmee kunnen we onze eigen industrie vergroenen, maar ook een hele belangrijke speler zijn voor andere landen. Welkom to this environment, to this port, to this city. Uh, Europe's most important energy hub. You say hydrogen hub, I say the port of Rotterdam. Uh, the um, ambition that we already have, uh, we are the energy port for Europe, we are the energy hub, and, and we need to stay that with hydrogen as well. So it's inevitable that these parties work together. This is really the new economy. This will lead to really a tremendous amount of jobs. Hydrogen might have a long way to go, but it is the ultimate answer for sustainable aviation. Hydrogen will be the new diesel. Uh, this is actually the smallest device here, smallest hydrogen production uh, device. We have our own press on the button hydrogen, so it's very safe. Europe will continue banking on hydrogen, and especially green hydrogen, as a clear part of our clean future. Uh, we will present detailed plans to repower Europe with clean energy. So I think now it's time to present real-life cases that hydrogen can be used to green up the economy, to green up our business. That this is not only a port pursuing an energy transition, it's an industrial facility uh, integrated operational cluster trying to achieve decarbonization and energy security. Europe needs a new narrative and we built it on coal and steel. We need to continue it now with hydrogen and all its derivatives. And ladies and gentlemen, it is possible to do that.